Well, a new variant of the virus that causes COVID-19 is now here in Louisiana. Researchers at LSU Healthcare Shreveport found it in two samples from Baton Rouge. As Victor Georges reports, there's no cause for concern right now, but there are some ways to limit these mutations from happening. B1630 is what researchers are calling this mutation of the virus that causes COVID-19. The mutation this time around is found on the spike protein, which is what your body uses to detect danger and fight. And that helps it evade the host immune response. Vaccines are still going to be effective against this variant, and this variant is not cause for concern at this point. It's, we've only detected it in a few samples. Although only 79 samples of this mutation have been found in the U.S., Dr. Krista Queen from LSU Healthcare Shreveport says they're closely watching it. It's important right now, while Delta is still so prevalent, that we keep an eye on anything that's not Delta. That way we can start to see if those are going to increase in um, abundance or if there's any changes happening that we need to be aware of. She says these mutations are completely natural and normal behavior from the virus. When it's copying its genome to make new copies to infect other people, it will mutate or it'll change parts of its um, genome, parts of its sequence. And so those are what give rise to these variants. Although natural, Dr. Amanda Logue from Oxner Lafayette General says when there are surges like the one the state just witnessed, there's more room for mutation. So there's tons of virus floating around at that time throughout all of the um, community. And so every time the virus replicates, there's a chance for it to mutate. So there's some thoughts that when that replication gets going so strongly that mutations happen. Both Dr. Logue and Dr. Queen agree. Vaccination is the best way to keep these mutations from happening because it stops the virus's ability to replicate within us. In Lafayette, Victor Georges, KATC TV3. Now you might be wondering why this variant is named a series of numbers in one letter. We found out similar to hurricanes, viruses and their variants have naming scales. So far B1630 does not have a Greek alphabet name like the Delta or Mu variant because only a small proportion of samples have been studied.